Sometimes cultivated land is prepared in a way that creates heaps or ridges and furrows. As part of the Soils for Africa campaign, you might have to sample soil on such land. The ridges on such land have been created by topsoil scooped up from the parts of the land that turn into furrows. On this land here, the topsoil layer that was scooped out to form the ridges was about 20 cm deep. So the furrows are 20 cm below the original surface level and they already represent the subsoil. This is true if the land was prepared recently because over time some of the topsoil that forms the ridges washes down into the furrows and creates a thin layer of topsoil upon them. So if the ridges are freshly made, sample them to collect your topsoil sample. and sample the furrows to collect your subsoil sample. If the land was not prepared recently, drill out the first 10 cm layer in the furrow and discard it. Then drill down to the 40 cm mark on the auger. So then you have reached the 20 to 50 cm layer and that's the soil you collect as your subsoil sample. <laughs> 